Greetings, free people. This one should be short and to the point. Hopefully. Now it's a great uprising. Yeah, man. Grand uprising. Yeah, man. Well, we also said grand rising. People have now where have them eyes open, you know. I kind of follow suit with the narrative, so we do give thanks. Yeah, we do give thanks. Now we say give thanks and praise to the mystic laws of the universe and its protective functions and forces in nature that guide our thoughts and our path in all ways that are lawful, correct, and positive. We do give thanks and praise. We keep it simple. Now with the West Indian Islands, Jamaica's crime problem. The usurpation of the common law of the land by the Admiralty Commercial Law of the Sea. When the West Indian island of Zamayaka, Jamaica, gained independence in 1962, the murder rate was 3.9 per 100,000 habitants, one of the lowest in the world at that time. In 2021, 59 years after the independence, Jamaica had 1,474 recorded murders for a murder rate of 52 per 100,000 habitants or people. The highest murder rate in the world now I hear people complain about the laws and the laws need to change and all of these laws, laws. And this is my perspective. If from 1655 when the British invade our location, and propose to govern and rule our location as colony. Up until 1962, when we get purported independence, the murder rate approximate to 3.9 per 100,000 habitants or people. And then after we get independence, it skyrocketed. We was one of the lowest, have one of the lowest murder rate in the world. To the highest murder rate in the world. And then we say what created that change? Then we said the usurpation of the common law of the land by the admiralty law of the sea when the West Indian island of Zamayaka, Jamaica, became a commonwealth by the Provincial Act or Provisional Act of, nine, of 19 July to the 6th of August 1962, the government in the United Kingdom relinquished their responsibility for the government of Jamaica. However, the UK mandate legislative powers or legal authority to the government of Jamaica. Now, what's the legislative power? Legislative mean having the power to make laws. What's the why legislator is a deliberate or contemplative assembly with legal authority to develop legal standards alternatively used as rules and regulation guises laws for a political entity 
such as a country, nation, or city. Now, legal standards are often in contrast, conflict, contrary to the common law of the land maintained by the constitutional charter as amended by Assent 2011. Now, when it's a political entity, it's a, a legislator, is a deliberate or contemplative assembly, meaning a congregation or a group of people or a body politic, assembly with the legal, not necessarily lawful, legal authority to develop legal standard. Because from your legal authority, you only can develop legal standard as a political entity. Such as the government of Jamaica is a political entity. Because we are say, the West Indian island of Jamaica consists of the definition that is within the, the Independence Act of 1962, while the country governed by Jamaica, or the government of Jamaica, which is a country, again, is just a political entity. So it's have its own political community. This is why when I say I renounce it from being a citizen of the government of Jamaica. You understand? Because as an Awak Indian here in the West Indies, making I a West Indian, so the designation Awak Indian should not be strange anymore. I remember when it used to be, should not be strange anymore. Yeah, man, so as Awak Indian, we're not supposed to participate in a foreign, you yeah, know, politics. Yeah, we're not supposed to be voting into these things. Right? It's separate and distinct from us. This is why you see the definition or the breakdown of a legislator, it deals specifically with legalities. This is why you have a substantive law and you have procedural law. And substantive law usually deal with specific you know, say, laws where govern the individual. While the procedural laws deal with the establish rules and method or establish court rules and method, put it that way, method of operating within the court. But as we go along, we're going to bring them definition there and read the definition accordingly. So the item can break it down for themselves naturally. Yeah, man. So it says the legal standards are often in conflict, contrast, contrary to the common law of the land maintained by the constitutional charter as amended by Ascent 2011. Why am I, may I use that as... The example there is because you can just type into Google and find this specific constitutional charter as amended. And that is the law. You know what I mean? Where it said, no organ of the state, parliament shall make no law. And no organ of the state shall take no action to abrogate, abridge, or infringes the fundamental rights and freedom guaranteed and secured by said constitution when i forgot no further than there 
any other law presented is void once it's contrary to the common law of the land. So we say, allegedly, there is no separation of powers between the legislative, executive, and judicial branches of government that is operating under admiralty maritime laws of the sea by way of uniform commercial code, which contrast conflict and is contrary to and is in fact the usurpation of the common law of the land maintained by the constitutional charter as amended by assent. Again, right back to the very law. When you talk about law, we can direct you to the substantive law and it's specific. It's not the procedural law with its generality. Now we say on elected foreign bureaucrats implement public policy by way of legal standards alternatively used as general rules and regulations so usually a foreign people are implement all kind of things as policy public policy and then our our supposed to be government mandate these foreign policies and and impose it upon the, the the populace upon the habitants of this west indian island yeah man now we have what is known as bill of rights bill of rights sometimes called a declaration of rights or a charter of rights is a list of the most important and fundamental rights to the original inhabitants of an island and to the citizens of a country a structure that specifically that way God, not every habitant within a it has a an island would be considered a citizen of a country. Yeah, man. The citizen of a country is where you find a political entity or the political community. We are talking about specificity. We're being specific now. Yeah, man. So the Bill of Rights. one of the most in, important and fundamental rights to the original inhabitants of an island and to the citizens of a country. The purpose is to protect those rights against infringement from public officials and private citizens. Really, yeah, protect yourself from the very same people who purport themselves to be of service to you the people god the government is a service construct put it that way and as a business it can only make offer offer to provide service which they can choose to reject Yeah, man. So again, bill or charter of right is of the utmost importance as it guarantees and secures the rights and freedom of the original inhabitant of the West Indian island of Jamaica from the encroachment of the political entity known as the government of Jamaica. The bill of rights or the bill of charter or the Charter of Rights is also the binding contract that holds the public service authority of the political entity, Government of Jamaica, accountable for
for their intercourse with the original inhabitants of the West Indian island of Zamayaka, Jamaica. Charter of Fundamental Rights and Freedom, as amended by Ascent 2011, is the Jamaica Bill of Rights, which is contractually binding upon the State Public Service Authority and all its agents by way of an oath of office and their bond. Public oath of office and bond, meaning insurance, just in case they make a mess out there. Charter, a document granting certain specified rights. So we're getting specific, specified rights, powers, privilege, or functions from the sovereign power of a state to an individual, corporation, city, or other unit of local organization. The most famous charter, Magna Carta or Great Charter, was a compact between the English King John and the barons, specifying the king's grant of certain liberties to the English people. Compact. A formal agreement or contract between two or more parties. So here again is a charter. Represent an agreement or a contract. So this is why you invoke I acknowledge and accept your public oath and bond made on the penalty of perjury. You know what I mean? So this is how you initiate the public oath. This is how you initiate a contract, right? It's a public offer. You understand? Now... <clears throat> We said Jamaica is no longer a colony by way of the Independence Act, but now a commonwealth maintained by the constitutional common law of the land pursuant to the 1962 Independence Act. The West Indian island of Zamayaka, Jamaica, or Commonwealth of Jamaica, is a sovereign and independent land of the Greater Antilles located on the North American continent and the latitude and longitude of the island nation are 18.15 degree north and 77.30 degree west. And we give thanks for that kind of information. Now we are touched the very same second schedule section three. Amendments not affecting the laws of Jamaica, where it has a diplomatic immunities in section 461 of the Income Tax Act 1952, which relates to exemption from income tax in the case of certain Commonwealth representatives and their staff in subsection 2 and subsection 3 for the word Tanzania. There shall be substitute the word Jamaica. Two, in subsection six of section 100 of the Diplomatic Immunities, Commonwealth Countries and Republic of Ireland Act 1952, after the word Tanzania, there shall be inserted the word Jamaica. You understand? Now we can correct it and say Zamayaka as West Indian. Yeah, man, we're not for the American Indian. That's why we like to say American Indian, West Indian, Meso American Indian. But again, step by step. Number three, in subsection five of section one of the diplomatic immunities conference with Commonwealth countries and Republic of Ireland Act, after the word Tanzania, there shall be inserted the word Jamaica. Now, when I'm looking at this, I'm seeing where as long as you're designated as a commonwealth, anything at all, you automatically have diplomatic immunity, naturally. Someone such as I, naturally, by according to the very documents, 
that created the government structure that is now extant. This is the law. I'm not guessing when I'm saying it. Some are presented. I will keep it simple. Again. You know, opportunity for sheer information. And the item know around this West Indian area. Yeah. It's only the Awak Indian nation I bring the information this way. Grassroots accordingly. The learning never cease. Yeah, man. So as we move forward, we are improved. We are learn. We are get more precise information. We don't have a problem. Or adjust ourselves. Or rearrange ourselves. Or correct ourselves. We don't have those issues. No macho man mess over here. We don't have an issue. Once we present information and once again rebut information where we can learn from those corrections and move forward. We don't have them issue there. So again, West Indian Islands, salute out there. Salute out there. Let me see how far the time go. 20 minutes, my probably can touch upon the West Indies for a brief minute or two. Wrap it up right here. Yeah, man. It's a step by step process, it's a journey. This is where you find everything, all the experiences is on the journey. Uh, when the journey is complete, that's it. So the highs and the lows, the ups and the downs, the in and the outs, the round and about, it's a part of the journey called life. So you have to find beauty in any aspect of it. And you have to truly try to make the most of it. And again, it now for do nothing to do with just the material aspect of things where you know you have to drive fast and drink and get drunk and act silly. Not like that. Again, it's about the state of mind, it's about the clear conscience. You know what I mean? It's about the clarity of thought. Yeah, man. So even when you're in the gutter or you're in the big dirty ghetto or anywhere for that matter, it's incumbent upon you to choose to rearrange or to adjust or to amend yourself in order to improve and become better. That's a free will exercise. Yeah, man, but I know everybody really have that kind of essence within them. What essence is that? The essence of nobility, the essence of goodness, the essence of class. Most people totally void of sophistication have absolutely no etiquette they are on totally mute in the intellectual department however these kind of people are celebrated why because they are entertainers they are propped up to be worshipped 
as divas. And now that we in this day and age, you can discover say, most of the ones them were completely unrighteous shall be exposed for them lucivious conduct out there. I always celebrate the union of man and woman or even male and female, that union. But the unnatural union of man and man and woman and woman because of its unnaturality to nature, then I am on can sponsor, support, or endorse that kind of unnatural behavior. So this is why we say fire burn for any drag queen pretending to like man when in truth and in fact on our man hater. Lightning earthquake and thunder. For them bad behavior. I will leave it right there. West Indians. Yeah. Tough up on herself. Big up on herself. Yeah, man. Broad out on herself. God, now we are getting clarity. Yeah. When we say West Indies, we say the West Indies consist of all the way up in a South Carolina, which is what they call the United States. And it goes all the way across to the East, up in Mexico, and come all the way down in South America, down in Venezuela. All of that is called the West Indies area or the West Indian area or the West Indian Dominion clarity. So we're now going off the back and forth with the mainlanders. Yeah. And talk about for them kind of slavery. We were what them called the Gula, Geechee. Yeah. Seminal. Yeah. We. Yeah, man. God, them always, I got divide. We and I will fight against each other. But I got have us from the south. Yeah, we always have problem with the north. God, the invaders came from the north, my people. Yeah, and from the east. Yeah, and we are talking about the. Today's proximity. We are not talk about turn them up upside down and revert. No, we are talk about what is at this present moment. Yeah, man. So when someone are talk about oh, on the islands and the islands, yeah, man. We heal and we rep West Indies, West Indian area. Yeah, and. As my day I talk it, we probably can present a map. Let me see if I can share this map just since we're there and I wrap it up. Uh, I don't like stay out on the road too long anymore. How can I do this? Let's look like it. Map of the West Indies and beautiful. You can clearly see, you know, a general chart of the West Indies by Captain J.S. Spear. And so, wait, I'll show you. The English in a red. Yellow Spanish guy, if we were Spanish, they'd have run the cut them time, yeah. Spanish first come around, yeah, come body top. 
and the United States of it area, you know. The blue are the French, the orange are the Dutch, purple are the Danish. But we can look. It's a uh, West Indies, part of South Carolina. So all of them places are West Indies, my people. See there, Savannah, Georgia. Remember me telling about Jacksonville? When you come out of this I-95, when you come down to St. Mary's, when you come out of Savannah, come out of St. Mary's, you come in at Jacksonville, Florida, yes, sir. Yeah, man. And show me is a man on this side of my road. So I'm going to go all the way up. When I talk about Philly, it's actually Pennsylvania. What I can tell them about Allentown. Yeah, man. And Morristown. That's like a place there. Yeah, man. But, and, you know, that's when we touch upon some places up north. But, yeah, when we say we are Gula, when we say we are Geechee, see it here? West Indies. So all of them places are West Indian people like I. Mainlanders and I hear that. Parts of South Carolina, Georgia, all of them places. So you say Louisiana, what am I talking about? Our place. You know, you may tell them of Florida, our place. Yeah, man, and it got all the way across. See? West Florida. See? Come all the way across. And the very same West Indies area. I met them fool you and talk about. Oh, are those them little islands here? No, I'm on it. Include South America. Go all the way down to Venezuela. All of them places. Yeah, I'm on. I want to see it there. Uh, we are called West Indies area. So this is why they are talk about Caribbean and I regulate it to a little area. Because when I have them kind of information, yeah, you know, the main screen, mainstream schooling system. You know what I mean? You never get this information, man. To His Royal Highness. George Augustus Frederick, Prince of Wales, etc., etc., etc. This chart of the West Indies is humbly subscribed, inscribed by His Royal Highness, faithful and obedient servant Joseph Smith Spear. Um, I like this map. Yeah, man, and again, for the people um, where things say uh, Jamaican, Jamaican, would us stand alone by ourselves. No. This is our area. And then Babylon come and change it. You understand? Yeah, the invaders come and mash it up. This is our area. See it? Oh, gosh. I really full joy this map. I'm going to share some other information with different maps. But, you know, sometimes you hear so much nonsense out there. And this area is not China. has nothing to do with China. So everybody we are foreign to this area, we can call them migrants, not just an immigrant. They just come here and decide so they want to take over this location. And because most of our people, you know, fell asleep it's, yeah i would just wake up you know then them get away with a lot of nonsense however give thanks to the most i we are here you know what i mean yeah man give thanks to the most i our work indian nation in america is here because america is a super continent but our location is the West Indies. And our map declare our area. Yeah, our designated area. Yeah, man. The Awak Chief Dominion. We don't have to fuss with nobody. We don't have to fight with nobody. 
You get me? Let the certification speak for itself. Because the very map for me show you is a certificate, certificate of fact because it have a stamp and seal on that very map that come out of the Library of Congress. Again, information share. It's neither here nor there. It's just information share. Clap it up out there, free people. Clap it up out there, West Indians. Clap it out out there. Awa cans. Clap it up out there. Za Maya cans. Yeah, man. Give thanks and praise. So much information. We touch back on next day and talk about substantive law and procedural law and which one deal with specific and which one G deal with generality. Now remember, when we say generality, we know say deceivers, you know, operate in generalities. So as we go along, people, step by step, unorthodox, grassroots, information share. Again, it's neither here nor there. It's just information share. Complete gratitude.